Welcome, Chocolatiers. I'm reacting to the state of play. I'm excited. Hope they show off Concord and Astrobot. Um, they got a little countdown for us. Four, three, two, one. That was kind of epic for no reason. Are you fucking kidding me for a 30 second countdown? Ain't no way to do like two countdowns, bro. Ain't no fucking way to do two countdowns. Fuck these motherfuckers. What's up with the Chocolatiers? Back with another video today. And uh, reacting to the PlayStation State of Play right now. This video has actually been eight minutes, but they just keep having multiple countdowns, so. You guys will only see this part and want to cut a lot of shit. Thank you, PlayStation. Hi, everyone. I'm Asad Kizilbash, head of product at PlayStation Ooh. Studios and head of PlayStation Productions. I'm here to welcome one of the newest members of the PlayStation Studios family, Firewalk. This team brings together yeah. some of the most talented developers in our industry with an incredible pedigree in the online multiplayer space. We announced their first game, Concord, last year. And today, the they are showing our Concord gameplay captured in engine on PS5. But first, here's an extended vignette introducing some of the cool characters you'll find in the Concord Galaxy. Enjoy. Yay! Space game. I'm excited. Crater City. I don't like these characters. We will. we will. I'll be waiting outside. Uh, no one moves. We'll be taking this off your hands. Whoa. This? Funny. Oh shit. Okay. They're cooking. What the outriders? So it seems like it's gonna be four or five team like co-op. One off, this is you. I am developing taste for destruction. Goodbye. <laughs> I'm definitely playing with my boy out there. It's B Max, bro. Or Baymax, Baymax. Or Big Hero 6. Don't 
behind me. What are you doing? Perhaps you should have let go also. Enough. Do not dare. Only we're supposed to stick together. <laughs> if you let go, I swear I will be. Oh, look, there they are. Hi. Look. I am glad you avoided a disturbing death. Almost dying is the best way to learn how not to die. Or something. I knew this was going to work. This wasn't the plan. No, it just wasn't the one we started with. If this is story based, this is for me, guys. I know, I know it's some gameplay yet. Everyone there cut. Did you like carry it around with you for emergency bland situations or whatever? Hey, Mark. Don't joke about something like this. Our next job is somewhere with less scaffolding. No scaffolding. Zero scaffolding. I, I promise. We were apart for so long. I, I thought I'd never feel your fire and grace again. You so Okay. That was a good trailer, bro. Now give me now give daddy that gameplay. Concord. Set in the vibrant sci-fi universe of the Concord Galaxy. In Concord, from the moment you log on, you are part of the crew of the North Star. A group of guns for hire known in our galaxy as free gunners. Free gunners are those lucky enough to be free. Shit don't look as good. <laughs> they take high stake jobs on worlds across the wild space where they face still gonna be fun, though. competitive free gunner crews. Here's the very first look at the gameplay of Concord. Free gunning. Gameplay! It's work, but it's our work. And we don't take it for granted. Being a free gunner means. Well, you're free. Right on target. Hey, you better run! Three gunners have a shot at making something of themselves. A chance to be someone. Right. Yeah, I'm gonna be homeboy right here, bro. You got the dual pistols? Or he did in the trailer. Oh, no, he didn't. Homegirl did. Oh, yeah, he still looks fun as hell, though. Our child. He looks badass. This looks just like Kill the Justice League, though. It's that first person. It does arguably look better, but same idea. With the free gunner crew of the North Star, and together, we're going to make our mark on this galaxy. Concord. Still kind of confused what type of game that is. We lean on the strengths and background of our team to make a tight, well-balanced FPS that feels great to play. We focused a ton of our attention and our tech on building a strong gameplay foundation of tight core movement, precise visceral shooting, and expressive abilities. We ended up finding ourselves influenced a lot of fighting <laughs> games and even started... Black Man is a lead gameplay designer game about damn time. Their characters makes every fight, every I'm just joking, there's probably different. plenty. Leaning into the asymmetry of the characters, really pushing the possibility space of two different characters colliding, it's all about creating opportunities for improvisation. That's where we can get out of the way and let players find their own magic. We also have abilities that are meant to have impact beyond direct combat. Deployable gear that can persist throughout a full game, so whether that's multiple rounds of mode, 
or multiple respawns across a the match. There are healing pads, bolt blocking domes, explosive traps, lane blocking walls. Yes, yeah, so this is like your team a co-op. Okay, so you're fighting another team. Plan ahead, and depending on where and what happens, players can shift the battlefield to their advantage. <sighs> We've got everything from mystics and medics to gunslingers and sparked robots. Every character they lost brings their me. own unique personality, skills, and wide-ranging perspectives to the crew. Every week, when you log into Concord, you will be welcomed with a new cinematic vignette that will give you a chance to see our characters off the job. They will feature ongoing narrative arcs that grow the characters' stories and relationships and unpack the broader So what they did was they filmed, I guess, about 20, 30 hours worth of shit, and they're just going to draw it slowly. to share that we'll be hosting a pre-launch beta in July, <coughs> by Concord's global launch on August 23rd, 2024. What? August game? I'll play it in July, give a first impression. Pre-order starting June 6th, and you get beta access for you and for your friends. Huh? So it's a it's it's five v five. Pre-order to six this next week. I just want to know how much that shit costs because that looks like a forty dollar game. With God of War on PC. Okay. You seem like a good game. Person. Need to replay it. This was so much harder to replay. Too open worldy. I don't know why there's always a trailer for these. I just say it's coming to PC. I know what this game looks like. Pay twenty fucking dollars for that. After I bought the pledge edition, by the way, I gave them money. She's just included for homies. I see how it is. Nah, I really don't give a shit. September not damn. Why does that feel like such a long way? Why Concord you have to wait to pre order? Why is that not why is that going up June 6th? What the fuck? June 6th. Very so curious that price. That you like. Oppress the people for personal gain. And the people must turn no. to bigger people. Omega Force! Perhaps I don't know who that company is. Way of lamenting the state of the land. Men are powerless. A new dynasty warriors? But even so, someone must act. I'm actually get this. Okay, we'll go. Oh yeah, baby. I'll play the hell out of this for a day and then beat it. Damn! My god! Yeah. Woo. In a world of chaos. Unnamed with zero rises. <laughs> Dynasty Warriors Origins next year. I'll buy that. That looks fun. I love those type of games. It's just you're in an open zone and you're just beating the shit out of people. I think I was dreaming. It wasn't a dream. You <gasps> both really transported to Maryland. What in the fuck? The path of a stylist is never easy. So, what a total ship change in the last two ga three games they showed. Ready? Pokemon? No, oh, man. Is it really just a game where you fucking jump? And turn to a cat. Okay. 
the fuck is this? Like, it doesn't look bad. It's probably more pop polished than half the ships came out, but... It looks more polished than Concord. I'm so sorry, but you turned to a fucking cat. Get the hell out of here. I know a particular person who loved this shit. What the hell are we doing? What are we doing? So it's a picture game, but then you jump? And there's no fighting, but then you can turn to a cat sometimes? Infinity Nikki. Test? Wait, test? The fuck are they testing? I'm actually so confused. Why do you say stars like Nemesis? Loki had my cock soaring. He's got a sword that means he's gonna be combat I decided already. Tailing tits. I don't care if she had a tail. No fuck. Actually, I do. She wouldn't fuck me with that tail. Oh man. Oh, you play as that big dude? What? <laughs> Focus on games coming out the later half of this year. Like, three or four of these have been literally saying 2025. Skydance is behemoth. Skydance, the fucking movie company that does Mission Impossible. It is! <laughs> they make games now for VR. I thought I could be a hero and break the curse. Whoa! But I was a fool. Developer of Walking Dead. There's no peace. And the gods that walk among us thirst for death. He's like, come on, motherfucker. Ow! Why does this Loki look ass? Oh, he went. Ah! This shit looks gas. Only monsters do. Available this fall. Dude, I'm not gonna lie, if I had a PSVR, I'd get this shit. This is gas. Ah! Join the hunt. Hell, I would if I had a PSVR. That shit like $400. For them to release two games a year. And one of them's usually awful. And the other one's usually okay. Is this the alien game they've been talking about? Oh my god, it's the alien game! Oh my god, oh it is. Oh yeah. I just hate how like, they all just kinda look shitty. Cause like, you can tell, yeah, like that looks awful. 
probably be fun that I'd play this. Rogue Incursion. Watch it say this year. See, make that make sense. Why did I get more gameplay? Dude, I might need to get a PSVR too. That might be the move right now. I play those two games. I will. I will play those two games for sure. Starting with a highly anticipated PvP shooter, playable soon on PS5. Oh my God! It's Marvel Rivals. I've been waiting for a console release. Please have a fucking release date. Please let it be today. This game looks so awesome. I would give them money. I hate to admit that, but I would. Like, I would give them money for skins and shit. Oh my god. That looks so fun. Adam Warlock. Oh my god. I'm actually getting excited. I've been wanting to play this so badly. I don't have a PC. Boy, if this releases in at least the next few weeks, I'm gonna scream, dude. Please come out. There's team ups. Oh, that's awesome. Structural environments. no date though for this year but I'm playing the shit out of that mate. I hate it's clothes. You gotta have to get to that shit. I'm playing that game. Oh my god you fight magic guard. It's like Rise of Ronin. DLC. This is. It looks pretty good. Whoa, Places Studios. Grand Turismo 7. Hello, friends and fans. I'm super excited to Until welcome dawn. my pals back to the end Motherfucker. of the winter getaway. This unnecessary remake because they're making that damn movie. You can't hide from me, Michael. look the same. Everything looks the oh. fucking same. Justify fucking paying Mike, any price for this. Should be a free fucking upgrade. Not even 20 bucks, just be free. Looks so fucking insane! Hell is it me or do it look worse?
That Loki's irritating me. Coming to PS5. Fault motherfucker, I already got it. I already own it! What a waste of a spot. Path of Exile 2. Never played the first one. Let's see what this is about. So it's good. Grinding your games. Yeah, that fucking last trailer grinded my gears. Ogham was once a peaceful land. But each day descends further into madness. Lord Rings. Famine, plague, besiege us. The very earth is being poisoned. The Count's men, once our protectors, have turned us. Plays like Diablo, okay. Eh. Don't look bad. I might play it. I must be the one to face this nightmare. No use this time. I remove your head myself. Whoa, couch go up. Whoa. They they've got me here, I might get it. Play with the boys. Two early access. Oh, ah, uh, early access games throw me off. I need a full fucking release. Maybe I might wait for that. Actually, it looks good. <gasps> Excuse me. I'm sorry. I I was just Silent Hill. I should call it Silent Ass because that like, gameplay trailer they showed like a year ago was awful. I think you should stay away. This town, there's something wrong with it. Is it dangerous? Maybe. Ah! I'll be careful. <laughs> I'm not lying. I guess I don't really care if it's dangerous or not. Bitch. <laughs> I'm making myself laugh. I'm going. You saw give a damn what you say. I'm going. No. You shouldn't be here. It looks better. Gameplay's look a little better. Okay. Whoa. Looks better. Okay. the original. I'm actually very excited. Is Pyramid Head in this one? I don't know. Comment down below. Let me know if he's in it. Oh, <gasps> October 8th! The only thing here to get a fucking date. Yay! Oh! Capcom they have that thing today. Oh, shit. December, offering just a glimpse of what's in store for their celebrated franchise. Today, I am so excited to share the first full gameplay trailer Monster for Monster Hunter? Hunter Wilds. Yes. You know, it's funny, I've never even played a Monster Hunter game. I own, like, three of them. I've never played them. That's awful. Oh, yeah. Hell, I own the last one that came on Switch. Never got, spots, never played it. We can get things set up and ready to I'll go. play this one. And then we can get started. Girl's got big tits. This is gonna be great. You bet. I gotta play as her exclusively. I hope find them soon.
angry. Now to lead it away from the back. We'll make for the desert. This footage of him getting tore up, man. Capcom has been on it. They don't put out nothing but bangers now. Monster Hunter Wilds. What's that release date? I'll buy it. Hey, this is complete. No beta access. Next year. Okay, bet. Bet, cut. I'll be buying it. Better come out in the summer. Oh, you get a save data bonus if you played World and Ice. Uh, two games I own, I have not played. Astrobot game. I'm excited. Especially they had that haptic feedback crazy shit they had. It was like the best in that game. Chocolatiers, my camera decided to die. Uh, but thank God that was the last game that they showcased. Um, this state of play, I know people are going to bitch about it, but I liked it. I'm like, it kind of made me think about getting a VR, for example, because those two games, they should off look, get, look pretty good. The Alien 1 ain't really have no gameplay of. Uh, Concord looks fine. I'm going to try out the beta in July for sure. Uh, but I think the two standouts were the fact that Silent Hill got a release date finally and Astrobot has a release date, which I know we missed that because my camera died. But September 6th, that's a good meaty release date. I'm like, with this being all that's coming out, I'm like, I ain't bitching. So comment down below. Let me know your thoughts on uh, the state of play. Let me know if you guys are going to be hell playing most of this uh i feel like out of all those there's some there's some that i definitely will skip but i feel like the majority of those i'll at least try and so uh with that i will uh, catch you guys on the next one